All right, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to a new game called Black Mesa. Black Mesa is going to be a part of the Half-Life series, and well, I hope I'm going to like it, and I hope you guys will enjoy it. Alright ladies and gentlemen and welcome to episode 1, chapter 1, whatever, Black Mesa Inbound. Alright, let's go, play new game. This is going to be stage 2, emitters activating, preparing test specimen. This is gonna be fun, really, really, really fun. So let's see, loading over here at capacitors, right. Should've been game there, uh, of course. That creepy sound again. Ah, oh, I remember this channel. Black Mesa, New Mexico. Good morning and welcome to the Black Mesa Transit System. Cool. This automated train is provided for the security and convenience of the Black Mesa Research Facility personnel. The time is 8.47 a.m. Current topside temperature is 93 degrees with, with an estimated high of 105 the Black Mesa compound is maintained at a pleasant 68 degrees at all times. Pleasant, eh? That's a lot. That's a lot. A little chilly, isn't it? Really? Why is it loading here? is a high security area beyond Sector C. You will need to return to the Central Transit Hub in Area 9 and board a high security train. If you have not yet submitted your identity to the retinal clearance system, you must report to Black Mesa personnel for processing before you will be permitted into the high security branch of the transit system. Yay. In event the fire use hammer to break glass. Due to the high toxicity of material routinely handled in the Black Mesa compound, no smoking, eating, or drinking are permitted within the Black Mesa transit system. inside the train at all times. Do not attempt to open the doors until the train has come to a complete halt at the station platform. In the event of an emergency, passengers are to remain seated and await further instruction. If it is necessary to exit the train, disabled personnel should be evacuated first. Please stay away from electrified rails and proceed to an emergency station until assistance arrives.
Well... Loadings do tend to take a while. A reminder that the Black Mesa Hazard Course in Decathlon will commence this evening at 1900 hours in the Level 3 facility. The semifinals for high security personnel will be in a separate secure broadcast transmission. Remember, more lives than yours may depend on your research. Position research associate. I'm a research associate. Where is the who would make a valuable addition to the Black Mesa team? Immediate openings are available in the areas of materials handling and low clearance security. Please contact Black Mesa personnel for further information. If you have an associate with a background in the areas of theoretical physics, biotechnology, or other high-tech disciplines, please contact our civilian recruiting team. The Black Mesa facility is an equal opportunity employer. and biohazard screenings are a requirement of continued employment in the Black Mesa Research Facility. Missing a schedule of your analysis or radiation checkup is grounds for immediate termination. Termination? If you feel you have been exposed to radioactive or other hazardous materials in the course of your duties, contact your radiation safety officer immediately. Work safe. Work smart. Your future depends on it. Oh, yeah, we have a leak here. Now arriving at, at, at Sector C test labs and control facilities. Please stand back from the automated door and wait for the security officer to verify your identity. Before exiting the train, be sure to check your area for personal belongings. Thank you, and have a very safe and productive day. Oh boy. Morning, Mr. Freeman. Looks like you're running late. Barney's been pretty scarce around these parts. Guess his bar tab must have finally caught up with him. Put some pep in that step, Freeman. You're late enough as it is. Mr. Freeman, I had a bunch of messages for you, but we had a system crash about, I don't know, 20 minutes ago, and I'm still trying to find my files. Just one of those days, I guess. They were also having some problems down in the test chamber, too, but I think that's all straightened out. They told me to make sure you headed down there as soon as you'd gotten to your hazard suit. They need you in the test chamber. Okay. Good morning, Dr. Freeman. Earlier, but the thermal protection system seems to be online now. You're living in the past.
Good morning. No smoking this day. Okay. Morning, champ. Hello. Oh, you people are so gonna die. Why do we all have to wear these ridiculous ties? Slick, Freemeister. Popsicle orange really brings out your eyes. Yeah, th the suit looks great. A bit snug in the back, though, buddy. What's happening, Captain? Screw you! Okay. I know that we gotta go really, really, really down. Go right on through, sir. Looks like you're in the barrel today. Hello. And we're going down, down, down. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Catch that last fluctuation. It's nothing to worry about. Hmm. Hello. We should harness the remaining photonic energy. What's up, Doc? Hello. Gordon. Ah, Gordon. There you are. Nice of you to finally join us, Doctor. We've just sent the sample down to the test chamber. We've boosted the anti-mass spectrometer to 105%. Bit of a gamble, but we needed the extra resolution. The administrator is very concerned that we get a conclusive analysis of today's sample. I gather he went to some lengths to get it. They're waiting for you, Gordon. In the test chamber. Right. Come on, then. I'll walk you down. Thanks. Eli has been busy making last-minute preparations for the new experiment. Greetings, Eli. Morning, Izzy. I trust this morning finds you well. Gordon, good morning. I'm glad you're here. These last-minute changes, they're a bit strange to just... Oh! It's about to go critical. What in the blazes is going on with our equipment? <sighs> it was never meant to do this in the first place. <sighs> it's nothing we can't handle ourselves, Eli. Run along, Gordon. We'll be but a moment. Yeah. Well, I'm worried about By Becquerel's ghost! The radiation you know, level is off the charts. <sighs> Greetings. Oh, there you are. Everybody's been looking for you, hombre. 
Ah, here he is. I'm afraid we'll be deviating a bit from standard analysis procedure today, Gordon. Huh? Yes, yes, but with good reason. This is a rare opportunity for us. This is the purest sample we've seen yet. And potentially the most unstable. Now, as long as we follow standard insertion procedures, everything will be fine. I don't know how you can say that. Although I will admit that the possibility of a resonance cascade scenario is extremely unlikely. I just don't feel... Gordon doesn't need to hear all this. He's a highly trained professional. We've assured the administrator that nothing will go wrong. Yes, you're right. Gordon, we have complete confidence in you. Well, go ahead. Let's let him in now. Yeah, first he puts down his glasses. So, what do I gotta do? Testing. Testing. <clears throat> Everything seems to be in order. All right, Gordon. Your suit should keep you comfortable through all this. The specimen will be delivered to you in a few moments. Now, if you would be so good as to climb up and start the rotors, that way we can bring the anti-mass spectrometer to 80% and hold it there until the carrier arrives. See people what happens when you mess with unforeseen consequences. Oh, you don't say!
status, uh, everything went to hell. Facility. We need to get to the surface and let someone know that we're stranded down here. There's no telling what kind of danger is. <laughs> My God, what have we done? Fascinating. Would you look at that? We can't afford to waste time. You'll need me for the retinal scan. I'm certain the rest of the science team will help you along the way. And for God's sake. Keep that suit on until you're in the clip. You hear me? Up you guys. Why is the... Whoa! on it. Okay, we're not taking the elevator. <laughs> Glad to see you. What the hell are these things, man? Why are they wearing science team uniforms? Okay, let's go for it. Why? I don't know. Don't let them get near you. job officer let's keep on moving this shit is something out of a sci-fi 
Yeah, you be careful in there, Doc. Yeah, it's okay. Just kill him. Let me get out of your way here. Oh boy. Okay, Doc. Grab what you gotta grab, but don't dodge. Where's my locker? Okay, Doc. Grab what you gotta grab. Gang stone. I think we have guests. Hoping to find a gun. Well, I guess that's not gonna be a possibility. Okay, let's go to the surface. I'm gonna stay here and keep a lookout for anyone else who needs. Okay, why not? I didn't want to die alone anyway. Huh. You're gonna die, bro. I'm not. Whoa! Hey, I got one! Hey, hip hip hooray for you. Yeah. One more! You feeling lucky? Okay. You gotta get to the admin office upstairs. There. 
Yeah, dude, it's static. Don't, don't even try. Nobody, dude. Oh. All right, I got a crowbar. get into it. Where is the gun, Negrito? Alright, I'm gonna end this episode uh, here, not to make it too long, and I'll see you guys next one. Bye bye. Alright, guys, and thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I really appreciate all the support you've given us. Uh, please comment, like, and subscribe for more awesome content. And please also check out all of these thumbnails around me for more fantastic content from projects. Alright? Alright, and until the next time, bye bye.